Welcome to Hunting Ghost. This here is Ted. Ted lives in a house. His roommate recently moved back to Michigan, but Ted believes his soul has remained inside his home, often distracting Ted from his studies. In this quote we have from Ted here, he says, It's, quote, super annoying. I decided it was time to pursue the hunt. Just like hunting anything, to hunt a ghost, you'll need to shoot it. We set up a camera in the room Ted described to have the most paranormal activity occurring. At first, there was nothing. But then, a shadow appears, seeming to be the shape of a bird. Ted confirms that birds were his ex-roommate's favorite animals. And things only got spookier from there. An unexplainable flicker of light. Possible evidence? Definitely. So far, the hunt proved clear evidence of unusual activity. Was it paranormal, or was Ted just an unusual guy? Upon revealing the tape to Ted, he disclaimed that he had forgot to pay his power bill. This explains the flickering lights. He believes the bird shadow could have just been him making shadow puppets while sleepwalking. Unusual? Yes. Paranormal? No. However, nothing could explain the final event that occurred that night of hunting. Prepare, for you're about to witness paranormal activity. You can see here a paranormal spirit sprints across the room. Ted confirms his ex-roommate was a sprinter. This would explain the ghost's quickness and agility. Is it possible that this is just another shadow of our imagination? Or could it in fact be the world's first concrete evidence of supernatural existence? That's up to you to decide. But remember, the tape don't lie. And if it looks like a ghost, moves like a ghost, and spokes like a ghost, it's most likely 100% a ghost. Definitely a ghost. This concludes Hunting Ghosts.